guys welcome back to the channel oh my god we just got really excited because we are out here trash picking and um we weren't sure if we were gonna come because yesterday it poured it was pouring pouring rain. pouring 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 cold. cold windy but it really cleared up and we were like we gotta go we gotta just try and there's stuff out so we're excited welcome back if you're new to our trash picking videos janine and i travel if we sort of travel to go trash picking like an hour um and we pick up what we can reuse ourselves what we can repurpose what we can donate what we can flip and sell we don't pick up everything because we don't do this full time it's more of a hobby it's more of like what can we save from the landfill sort of thing there are a ton of people who go out picking alongside us well not with us but like there's other people doing it there's other people um, on the road yeah so a lot of it gets saved cactus. we uh it's a cactus is that a fake cactus or a real <laughs> cactus we uh we save what we can we bring you guys along and um we just have a fun time last this is the second pick of the season and last time we found some christmas ornaments so we never know what you're gonna find in the trash we found some crazy amazing things we found a macbook pro one year crazy so we're glad you're here if you enjoy our videos and you're not subscribed consider doing that it really helps us out janine's itching to go so am i welcome give the thumbs uh give the video a thumbs up i'm just excited Will she ever stop? i don't think i'm Will going to stop <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Box. Little drawer box. Jewelry box. Jewelry box. Drawer. 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 <laughs> drawer. I can't say okay. that word. Okay. Oh, right. All right. Anyway. So here's one pile. Um, there's like markers. <laughs> Doesn't look like much of what we're after. No. A rug. Some children's stuff. Can you go a little? Just a bit. Keep going. Yeah. No. Tupperware containers. No, I think that's no, nothing for All us. Right. A shovel. I know last year you were looking for a shovel. Is the shovel we got from the I trash? Think, is it? I thought. I think it is. Oh, there's a big pile over here. Somebody's tossing their like um, what is that called? Uh, washing. Washing. Uh, dishwasher. Dishwasher. Yeah. And a the table. Smoker. smoker? Hmm? Yeah. A piece of luggage. Um, a printer. Oh, there's like Christmas. I'm just gonna pop out and say. Is gonna pop out? I don't think it's anything. I also have my gloves in the trunk, which I could grab. It's a little windy today. Oh, oh boy. Um, no. Oh, cats. No, nothing here for us. I'm going to grab my gloves though. This stop or house has a little sign that says well actually it's a quite a big sign that says free so we will take a look there's easter stuff cute oh these are fun like easter chocolate blow molds i like those and then there's some books here too children's books we could take a look at how cute cute i think i like the blow mold bunnies Easter. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of books. <gasps> Garf. How to draw sea creatures. Yeah. Rudolph, Clifford. Oh, this is the Get Along Gang. Oh yeah, you They're like from the things, 80s. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Deanna Jones. Garfield marches Garfield. on. Hello. Oh no, Paddington. How to give great parties for kids? Oh, that's so fun. I gotta look at that. <laughs> Mouse and oh, fun. Take Lots that. Stuff. What's this monster truck adventures? <laughs> These are from like the 80s, a lot of them. Oh, another Paddington. Is this Tommy DePaulo? Yeah, Tommy DePaulo. Oh, look at this. Professor Wormbug. For your mom, she loves the uh, Snoops. Yes. Like oh, there's a lot of vintage books. Tron. That's cool. What else do we have in here? Tron, like vintage Tron stuff. I wonder if that's worth anything. Vintage Tron. I don't know. Wow. Was oh, this a wrinkle in time? I think it's part of a wrinkle in time. Great book. Oh. There's lots and lots of books. Don't be moving. Oh, we gotta look at the books. 
Have you looked through them all, Janine? No, there's so many. Should I start to look through them? Yeah. Oh, is that little bear? That's little bear. Oh no. Should we take the snoops? Oh. Snoopy. Oh, look at that. Richard Scary. Cute. Television. Oh, these are all vintage. Horses. The bunny book. Oh, cute. Yes. It's me and you. Oh my goodness, I want to look through that. <laughs> That's cute. It's a personalized Christmas story. Cute. Different. Television. Oh, it's cute. So wow. many books. Now, we could One. take them all to donate, but we're gonna do that um but we're definitely gonna take a good amount mm. that we like um just because we took the super today so i'm not sure if we're gonna take too much today but we uh there's a lot of books here story of dinosaurs we just oh, found this book we did that's <laughs> so funny <laughs> we did <laughs> oh. pinocchio Wow, there's a lot here. Spot, I loved Spot. I just found this book. This are our scented rhymes for story times. So funny. Oh, yeah, this is the one I that. just found. So now we have two. Oh my goodness, how cute. How fun. Yeah, anything Disney would be fun to pick up. Like this one, Donald Duck. <laughs> look at that, this one has a Donald Duck. Wow, look at that Curious George. Fun. Dr. Seuss. Wow, these are all Charlie Brown. Looks like ah, one. Headless Horseman, we got more Snoops. Wow. Another oh. uh, uh, illustrated book. Lots of Richard, Richard Scary. Scary. Do you want the Richard Scaries? Uh, potentially, yeah. Here's another one. I got this. I'll take that Mickey, Mickey. Mouse. Yep. Wow, so many good books in here. I can't believe it. We're definitely going to be taking a large pile of them home. The Get Along Gang, Bugs Bunny, Janine, that's cool. Yeah. Wow. Tyrannosaurus. Oh, grab that one. Yeah. <laughs> Take that one. And Stegosaurus. Awesome. What is this surprise party? This is the Get Along Gang too? I don't know. Here's the dinos, Janine. Spot. Wow. What a great find. What a great little spot that we came across. I'm so excited. And they're all vintage. How funny is that too? Wow. All right, we got quite the piles that we're gonna be packing into the car. And then I think I'm gonna take these uh, blue mold bunnies because they do excite me. And uh, yeah, wow, that's fantastic. We've got our next pile here. Okay, are you gonna come out? Yeah. Janine's gonna come out. I got my gloves in case I need them. Um, Janine spotted this guitar case, which I doubt has a guitar in it. Yeah, it's empty. And then, um, suitcase. I like this little, like, um, drawer set. This is quite fun. I like that. And then, is this a foosball table? Is that what you call it? She went quality. Oh, that's pretty nice. Um, yeah, Janine said there was like a rolly cart thing. I don't know what she's- oh, this thing. Yeah. What is that? <laughs> is that for when we go to like estate sales? And we could just put all our stuff on there? And wheel it out? I'm just watching. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it. Okay, hold on. Yeah, yeah, bottom? yeah oh, it does. This bottom. pops down. It's just like a square on wheels. Yeah. Interesting. Like huh. I'm gonna need These are the types of things that excite Janine. 
I'm like, I don't know. I mean, I guess it's useful. It folds up really flat. It does. Well, Janine, it's your lucky day. <laughs> it folds up. And you found it in the trash. Here, oh, is the ninja in there? It's like a ninja coffee machine, I think, in there. I'm not gonna take it, we don't need that. Something to carry all those books in the house. That's, I guess yeah. that's true, yeah. Perfect. Look at this little, what is that called? I can't find my words today, where'd they go? Really excited about it, I'm guys. I'm so excited. <laughs> like, you ever have like a lot of groceries you need to carry in, and it's really heavy, and you only have two arms, and you only want to make one trip? Well, I don't feel like breaking my arms. Like I do? And my shoulder, like Laura does. <laughs> so, I'm really excited about that. I'm happy I think that's going to be great to help carry in groceries. Now, there's a pile right here that I'm quite interested in checking out. So, I'm yes. going to hop out and look at this. Um, might be nothing, but we'll see. Pickers here right before us. They went to the bags. Um, oh, some more books. More books. All children's books. Wow. More books to look through. That's fun. And um, some plush here. Yeah, they just like tore it open. We usually, you know, we do our best to tie things back up, leave things the way we found it. Um, as best as we can. Some Pokemon cards in here, among us. There's a whole bin of books, you mean. Yeah, here, Janine. Ooh, go check that out. That's fun. Yeah, we'll put all these plus back um, once I dig through it. Also, it's really hard to film and look through things with one hand, so take that into consideration too when you see me going through stuff. We always put it back, even if we don't um, do it on the camera. This guy's cool. I would pick him up, but he looks a little worn for my liking. Maybe. Maybe. Off oh, the whole thing of toys, Janine. Chubby puppy. Cute. What else? Penguin. Plush. Cute. Um. See, this is going to be hard to like tie back up, but we'll at least leave it upright. Um. Going over. Okay, I'm gonna use two hands and uh, report back if I find anything else in here. It's mainly like toys. Okay, so the only other thing I found was this dinosaur from the year 2000 for Janine. I like it. <laughs> and I'm gonna put all these back. And uh, were there books to look through? There's like lots of books. So maybe we'll look through the books over there. Yeah, those are all the books. That Arthur, look. Wow. Oh, he has a lot of children's books. We'll have to go through them. Okay, we'll look through them. I wasn't filming the whole time. I was looking through these Christmas books and I was saying, most of them look um anywhere, but look Grinch and look at this. The pokey little puppies for his Christmas. So exciting. Okay, it's getting really windy. Um, but yeah, I found this whole Christmas book pile. I think these two are I'm gonna take. Um I also found another Halloween one. Yeah, wow. This penguin one is cute too. Looks older cute what we have so far oh oh we'll just open this up and put the stuff we got in here how is this i couldn't look at it i figured we'll look at it back at home uh-huh because the wind was starting to blow the money mm -hmm. out so. we got a lot of books and look janine oh. picked up something for us to carry home in and we also found this little tiki statue uh just now yeah not broken so a little plastic guy made in china <laughs> he's fun nice nice wow that was cool janine that, we're just finding the books today. All children's books today, which is so fun. Janina and I um, collect and... Um, I don't know which way to go. Sorry. To left. Left? Yeah. We collect and... Um, we collect, like, children. Janine really collects children. <laughs> children's Halloween books. I like the Christmas. I like the Halloween. Um, or anything vintage, you know, whatever. And uh, We seem to be finding lots of books lot. today. Yeah. So we're gonna... And a dinosaur. And a dinosaur. And a dinosaur. A vintage dinosaur at that, yeah. technically. Um, bump. Oh. bump. Sorry, speed bump. So we're going to continue on, but yeah, fun. She was clearly a teacher. She had she yeah. teaching supplies. Um, I checked in the bins. It was mainly just the books. I guess those like uh, plush toys as well, but um, we picked up a lot of books. So that was really cool. Oh, no freaking way. Let's go. I hope it's not broken. Oh, my God, guys. 
guys oh, i need two hands if you guys he's broken i got real excited too fast <sighs> i wonder if that recently happened so sad but there is a vintage looking book over there some artwork Um, this is sad. This is sad. Hurts. I got so excited. <laughs> it looked really good from the back. It looked like clean and like not brittle and really promising. Um, but no, it was like actually broken, Janine. That's usually why they're in the trash, but sometimes we have actually found some really good blow molds in the garbage. Yeah, we found some amazing found things. Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to put in some pictures right here for you guys to see some of the blow molds we found over the past. We were trash picking before we started YouTube, so yes. I don't know, like five years. You get lucky sometimes. I think it's actually been like six years, seven years, but that unfortunately was not it. Poor Santa Claus. Everybody, Santa emoji in the comments. Little Santa emoji, RIP, <laughs> our good friend. <laughs> Small little pile here, but I saw something that caught my eye. What is this? Oh my gosh, more books. It's sort of bent up though. I'm not gonna take it. I do like it though. I don't think I'm gonna take it. A Barbie book. Oh my gosh, on location with Barbie. That's fun. Oh my gosh, what is this? I should put my glove on. <laughs> it's like a troll. Oh, is this Barbie? That's vintage. A troll? Oh my gosh, a troll for Janine? Dr. Doolittle. A ring box. Janine's gonna I should have put on my gloves I just I hopped out I got really excited um oh my gosh a nice bag we could put it all in wow all right I'm gonna grab this and uh wow there's so many some really cool ones that's amazing in this little unassuming pile that's why you gotta, you gotta train the eye. You gotta train the eye. I just had, I saw, you know what I saw? I saw this book. I was like, let me just go see. Wow. Okay. So surprised by what I found in that pile. You were like you speeding past it. No. I'm also curious what's in here. What this is. Oh. Are you gonna share? I mean, am, I'll bring it up to the front. It's small enough. It's a mystery box. What could it be? A box of pogs? Oh my goodness! That's gonna be so fun to look through. Can you believe that? There's a lot in there. Wow, there's slammers and everything. That's fun. Cool find, Laura. And you know, these are getting like more expensive and stuff at flea markets. Oh and yeah, like yeah. That. Wow. Thank you. In the trash. In the trash. This looks like a kid. It's coming from an older house too, which is always exciting. And it looks like there's older stuff. Immediately I see this. What is that? Oh man. Okay, we gotta be careful to like not leave a mess though, cause that's no fun. Janine might like this. Okay. I'm gonna I took the wrong glove for the wrong hand. Would you hold this for me for a second? <laughs> no, that's a hallmark, um that's a hallmark like animatronic Christmas thing. This is really cute. How cute is that little birthday mug? Oh we oh. have one, very similar. Very similar. Oh my goodness, that's so cute. If it wasn't broken. <laughs> wow. 1983. Mostly kitchen stuff. I'm not gonna Yeah, lots of kitchen stuff. Dig through this too much. This is cute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not so Irish coffee. Ah. Did your mom like that? No. <laughs> Older plush in here. Older plush, older glasses right there. This looks cool. Oh, oh, that's really cute. Oh, see a bank? 
I don't know. I thought something was a bank the other day and turned out it held baby powder and sprayed on me, so. <laughs> 1986 on this. Wow. Oh, oh, older plush. Look, the vintage Alfie. Is that Alf. his name? Alf. <laughs> house that I get so excited about because you could tell it's older stuff which of course is exciting but um most most of the times it's like that it's like not it's not vintage Christmas but um I didn't we didn't pick anything up from that pile I misspoke Jenny got the mug Ooh, the which birthday way mug. should I go um I don't know this Avon box caught my eye it says Easter but there's romance novels in there so we won't be taking that Star shower laser light empty box. Uh, stuff that I'm not gonna take. Poster. Oh, they're in there. Wow. I'm gonna move that to the front so somebody else can take that. We're not gonna take it because we wouldn't use it. Oh, it's like a Lennox, uh, Lennox lamp in here. You want a Lennox lamp? She said, oh, I don't know what that means. Um, means maybe, but this is just too big for us to flip and hold on to for Marketplace. We don't have our own like house, we rent. So I'll move it to the front and hopefully somebody will see it and take it. All these are in there. Um, what are these? I don't know what that. Oh, Rudolph is there too. We'll move him to the front. Um, what is this? Oh, bells, little bells. 12 Days of Christmas ornament collection. That's intriguing. Rudolph lost his hat. Somebody lost his hat. Um, Let's move it off to the front. Yes, the Lennox lamp we might uh, gift it to her mom. Uh, I'm curious if these are in here. These are newer. These are ceramics from like the 80s, so not super collectible. But if they're all in here, it's sort of cute. Oh, <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Am I going a little trash pick and loopy? Maybe, but we can donate. Okay, we're gonna say yes to those, and we're gonna pack this up. A lot of stuff here. I'm gonna put my gloves on. Look, somebody ripped it open. <sighs> Lots of toys. Try not to make any more of a mess. <sighs> um, coach boxes. Hollister bag. Barbie witch head. People should just like undo the top instead of ripping through the side. But I get it's hard to do, but I don't want to create more of a mess for anyone. Fun Bob, these books in here. This was out overnight. You could tell because it's wet. Lots of water just spilling everywhere. Um, this is all like books. Yeah, like children's chapter books, which may have gotten wet overnight. I don't think there's too much here for us, honestly. Yeah. This trash picking trip was all about books. We found so many books, Laura. I can't believe we found like a whole trunk full. <laughs> yeah, here it is, guys. Here's the haul pretty pretty good um we found so many books some spooky books which are so exciting we're gonna get a closer look see what we found um we didn't show everything that we picked up so let's get a closer look and see what we did pick up janine you found this little box on wheels you know this cart has already already come in handy <laughs> i popped it open and put a lot of the books and different things that we found in it to keep it organized in my trunk. And let's, let's see, let's see how this thing works. But she's on the go, guys.
I like it. This is the bundle of Halloween books that I pulled out of that box of books and didn't even bother to look through. So I wanted to show you guys some of what was in there. It was mainly like scholastic uh, soft covered books. But one of the more exciting ones in this pile was this Skeleton in the Cupboard book. It's a Halloween pop-up book and it's just so cool. Wow. He's shaking in there. That's really cool. It opens and has some fun, you know, pull tabs and things that pop up and move. So <laughs> I thought this was a really fun find. That is awesome. I've never seen that before. So that's really cool. The rest were more soft covered um, Halloween children's books um, that Janine has found over the years. But this one is definitely new to us and one of my favorite out of the pile. I love the illustrations and this is actually from the 80s. So a lot of really good books. This was just a small amount of the ones we found today. I was so excited to find Pokey Little Puppy's First Christmas. This book is from the 70s. Um, it's in pretty good shape considering, but I just love the illustrations. And it's so a Christmas cute. book. I also found this hardcover, How the Grinch Stole Christmas. It looks like it might have been at a library. Um, it is, yeah, it's from New Rochelle, New York, so it traveled a bit. And it's actually from 1957, so it's an older one. It's really cool. I don't think it's worth too much. I'll have to look, but still a really fun find. We found these two Tron books. This one in particular, I think, is like the movie storybook. So it might have like pictures mm -hmm. and stuff from the movie. That's pretty cool. It sells for like 10 to $15 on eBay, um, but pretty cool find. I found a couple Paddington books, so we had to definitely take those. How cute. I believe these are from 1970, or at least this one is. We each found a Disney puppet pop-up book. <laughs> <laughs> I found this Mickey and uh, Laura found the Donald one. We found some more Disney books like this Mickey Mouse book and some other golden books, you know, classics, Bugs Bunny and Richard Scary. Janine even found a dinosaur book, which is really fitting because Janine's doing something really fun this week. And what are you doing this week, Janine? Well, Thursday, March 28th, we're finally having our Whatnot Waffle Dino Party. Um, we're gonna make dinosaur waffles. If you remember a few weeks ago, we found the dinosaur waffle maker and I was like, we should make waffles on Whatnot. And uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna have a little dinosaur party and uh, some shenanigans will be had, I guess. It's gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna stream it to YouTube as well. So if you don't wanna tune in on whatnot, you can still watch it on YouTube. You just won't be able to um, purchase anything if there's anything to purchase, which there might be, and you won't be able to enter any giveaways. But um, if you just wanna watch it, you can watch it on YouTube as well. So we are very excited about that and we hope you guys do join. Mm -hmm. Janine might even read us um, the story of dinosaurs. Yes, word for word, page by page. <laughs> no, it's a cool book. Yeah, we found two, this is actually the second one of these mm -hmm. we found in recent videos, but we found like two other dinosaur books as well. Um, this is from 1982. What else do we have in here? The Paddingtons we went over. I think I grabbed all the Snoopy encyclopedias. I wonder if there's even a full set here. I don't know. They're not huge resellers or... Oh, what do you mean? Well, Snoopy look, Dino. Would you look at that? How fitting. Would you look at that? Fun. So there's that. There's a lot of different Snoopy encyclopedias in here. Um, I was saying the whole set sort of sells on eBay, not for a ton, but I just picked these up because I couldn't see them go to the landfill. And um, it's funny, right after we pulled away, we saw some people pulling up to the spot and looking at the book. So we're very confident that most of them did get saved. Um, and we pulled as much as we could to either pass along, donate, keep ourselves. So I think it was a good pickup for sure. These are the last few books. More Disney, Tall Tales of America. Wow, these were all like vintage books, which is just so crazy. Mm -hmm. Um, in this one spot, they were all like older. Mm, you know, that's cute. Yeah. So happy we were able to save a good, good amount of them. Yeah, me too. From the same spot that we got all the vintage books, I picked up these two blow molded chocolate bunnies. I've never really seen these before. Um, I don't think they're super collectible. I don't think they're that old, but I thought they were really cool. They're just little plastic blow molded chocolate bunnies for Easter. Janine picked up and spotted Booopoly, which is yeah. pretty cool. It's a Halloween Monopoly game. Uh, the board is kind of ripping, and I'm not sure if all the pieces are there, but when I opened it up, I noticed that the tokens or the playing pieces 
um, were there and I was like those are cool in itself so let me let me pick it up and um, maybe I don't even know like there's no instructions so I don't know how to play it I assume it's very similar to Monopoly um, but I want to show you guys look at these little tiny playing pieces they're little metal pieces you have a cat a bat a hat a pumpkin a ghost and what looks like maybe a candy apple yeah that's so fun these pieces in themselves are pretty cool and uh i think worth saving they would look really cute on display in like a little case or something like that for halloween yeah so. a little curio, ca curio cabinet yeah. um yeah even just for that i think that's a great find familiar yeah janine you didn't get to see this um oh my goodness <laughs> this is barbie like vintage barbie i it opens another way too this. you had that exact same one i think one? i had this or my sister had it oh see my it's goodness. like a game yes yes i remember this <laughs> because oh my goodness i loved the mini game for your barbie for your barbie <laughs> Yes, wow, it's just this unlocked a memory for me. I wonder if it still works if we put in new batteries. Wow. It's a little Barbie soccer game that you could, you know, carry around like a little purse. How cute of is course. that? Yeah, that's fun. I found that with um, some of the other stuff, but that's a fun find. Yeah. Yes, I found that with this Janine. I don't know if I sh showed this to you, no. but I found a Trolls <laughs> with the little with the little uh, jewel in the belly, belly button. <laughs> wow, marked Ace novelty. Yeah. Cute. Yeah. We did grab the Lennox, um, I guess candle lamp is what this is. It had all the original packaging. It's definitely been used before, um, but definitely still usable. Oh, not yeah. broken, I don't think. Not chipped. Um, it's very pretty. It is pretty. Yeah, it's got all the all the pieces, so definitely worth um, at least donating. Absolutely. Um, and alongside that were these um, J.C. Penny Twelve Days of Christmas ornament bells. I think this is when I was starting to go a little like garbage picking loopy, and I was like, <laughs> should I pick these up? And I did. Interesting that they're like in these little plastic containers. Yeah, they are the Twelve Days of Christmas uh, little ceramic bells. So. You've got, what, 10 Lords of Leaping. All the days are there. I don't think any of them are broken. So again, if anything, we will pass these along Aww. to the thrift store. Look at that, it still has the paper in it. Wow, and these are probably from like the 80s. What's hiding out in here? Janine picked up this happy birthday mug, which we actually, like, do we have this exact same one, Janine? If not, this one, we have, one very similar. Yeah, yeah, if it's not the same one, I, I think it's just similar. I don't think it's the exact. It's definitely from the same like maker or design though. Mm -hmm. um, so we got that. And then we picked up this little tiki guy, little uh, Polynesian inspired statue. It's not actual wood. I think it's like a resin or something, but he's pretty cool looking. And then I found this for Janine for her dinosaur party. A fantastic dinosaur. And he's actually from the year 2000, making him technically vintage. Last but definitely not least, I could not believe when I opened this little container that there are all these pogs inside. Oh, look at that. Pogs were just before my childhood, but I know they were really popular, and I know that bigger lots can sell on eBay. Um, there are just so many different designs in here. If you take a look, there are just tons and tons, so this is going to be really fun to look through. We'll probably most likely pass these along, whether that's on eBay or whatnot, but I mean, how fun and nostalgic are these? guys thank you so much for joining us in today's garbage picking adventure um if you're liking these videos at the end of this video we're gonna have a playlist over here or over here where you can watch all of our garbage picking adventures from the past few years and the garbage picking season has just begun so if you are enjoying these videos make sure to subscribe so you know when we upload new videos um we're gonna be trash picking a lot this season i think mm -hmm, it's definitely a lot of fun. we're having fun and we hope you guys did too thanks so much for joining us see you next time bye, bye.